The shape is perfect. Let me show you what they are. They're the round sunglass with tortoise. Let me double check on my colors here. Uh, the top one is, actually we're just gonna make this real basic and easy. There's black, brown, or gray. Black, brown, or gray. Uh, they are pretty, and they too come with this terrific case with the polishing cloth inside. These are here with free shipping and on three flex or four. Um, I do love the shape of your sunglasses, and you know, Bethany, you and I have very different shapes to our faces and our bodies, um, but this is just, again, a universal, I like that little bit of an oversized sunglass in this look, and of course, you give us all the protection from the sun that, that we want. So, another great design. We have done so incredibly well with the sunglasses. They have been rated so highly. They have flown off the shelves. I have had many celebrities ask me for them. They are just perfect. I have to say, they fit every face. They look good on everyone. They are comfortable. They are chic. They have that gold clutch that, you know, that's a sunglass case that has an attached cloth. They are rich, they are substantial, they are high fashion. Even the lenses uh, just have such a rich look and a gradation to the color. We just do eyewear so incredibly well and you're protecting your eyes. And there's no reason that you should be paying several hundred dollars <laughs> in an airport or at any store, you are absolutely just paying the markup. 100% you are paying the markup, you are being ripped off if you're paying hundreds of dollars for your sunglasses. Oh my gosh, and what is more heartbreaking than when you lose a pair? <laughs> yeah, I mean, I think paying that much is the most heartbreaking, honestly, <laughs> because you just know that you feel stupid and it feels good to wear something that looks so fashionable and that you've paid the appropriate price and I have so many major sunglasses and I wear my own Bethany sunglasses all the time, proudly and securely. And everyone asks me where I got them. Oh my gosh, you look so glam. You really do. Talk about it. But they're, and they're not exaggerated. Like they're just right. perfection. I yeah. have to say, we haven't seen one model, one person not look great on them. But when I'm going through the testing designing process, I go through everyone around me and my assistant, everyone. I've had assistants who look bad in every sunglass. They say they look like a bug. And I say, it has to look good on everyone for it to sort of pass through. I'm very particular about the sunglasses. They have to feel substantial. They have to feel high quality, fashionable, and they have to protect your eyes. Yeah, and, and once again, checked all the boxes. 100% UVB, UVA uh, protection, blue light technology. I do love that molded nose rest. Sometimes those little movable nose things, they can fall off and then they, oh, it's just like a, another nightmare. Uh, but all of this has been really, really fine tuned. And if, you, if you're watching tonight and you're, you do have Bethany's sunglasses that we launched in February and they sold out, you know the quality that you're getting with the Bethany design. There's nowhere else that you're gonna find them and they are here for you, no charge to ship. You've got a whole month to be able to uh, wear them, see how they feel and how comfortable they are. Once again, so nice to be able to put on top of your head and not feel like it's pinching or that it's gonna fall off. I mean, I can like move my head and they stay securely in place. And the coverage, I just, these are just so elegant. They really are well, elegant. Well, pull, no, pulling the hair and right. the hardware and the subtle logo. There's a little B at the end, a gold B. It's just very subtle. It's not about me, it's about your face and the framing of your face. Um, I thought of everything. It's the first product I ever put my own name on um, as a woman, as a mother, as a person who likes to, to dress fashionably, but likes value, doesn't like to waste money. I mean, I think about all of it and um, there's one end of the spectrum where there are multiple hundred dollar glasses that are at a drug, I mean, at a, an airport or on Fifth Avenue. And then there's the other end of the spectrum with the nine to twenty dollar glasses that are terrible because you think you're protecting your eyes and they're not doing anything and they're cheap and they break and they scratch and they're just not protecting you. So you have to protect your eyes. You got one set, but you want to look fashionable and you just don't want to spend an extraordinary amount of money. 
I couldn't agree more. Sunglasses are such an important accessory. Here again, they they protect your eyes. They, you know, help you from squinting through, you know, every sunny day that's out there because we know what's happening. Uh, again, the, the fine lines and wrinkles aren't gonna get better unless you're doing something about them. And this is one of those easy, practical ways to enjoy, a, gosh, they're comfortable. I just think these are so pretty. And yeah, you can spend hundreds of dollars. Yeah, you lip gloss and you're gone. No makeup, no black, no black circles. You just feel good when you put on a pair of what seem to be, and they're not. They look like they're expensive glasses. You put on a pair of high fashion glasses, put some lip gloss on, and go. And you're excited to run into somebody that you know because <laughs> no true. one's going to have them. They launched recently, and they're different. They're different. They're unique designs. They're substantial. They feel substantial that makes any sense like you know i like a sunglass to feel substantial not flimsy there's a difference in you know those sort of plastic and it feels light and it feels cheap i like when a sunglass feels rich i and they look rich i'm going to try all they of them on we've rich. got black brown and the silver gray brown is most popular right now here's the black to give you an idea how they look uh we're calling it oh this one is called gray okay this one's called gray and then this one, silver. How fun are these? I mean, that is just, look at how that pops against the, 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 the arms of the sunglass. Which one do you like best, Bethany, on me? I like, the, let me see it again, do it again. There was the silver, here's the gray, and then okay. here's, here's the brown. I like the brown. I yeah. like the brown. It just like, cool. yeah, it's like, I like the brown. What do you like? Well, you know, the truth is, I love all three of them. I mean, really, I, it's funny, when I, when I was getting ready for our show tonight, I realized I collect glasses and sunglasses. It's the one thing I just love, partly because I guess I'm always leaving them somewhere, but I just love reaching and having an option at the front door, in my car, in my purse, even at I the know. office, it's right? It's a top of personality. It's yeah. a moment. It's, I have them, too. I have them in my car. I have glasses that I take on my beach walk. I have glasses that I keep in the car. You have glasses for vacation that sometimes you're going on a more glamorous vacation and you're trying to be dramatic. Sometimes you're just running and you want to be sporty to go grab something at the coffee place. And it's so true. We offer a closet full of personality sunglasses and I like that. And they, but, and I, but I needed to design them to look good on everybody. Yeah. Because I don't like when a sunglass doesn't clear your eyebrow. That bothers me. I've had then when I'm putting a hat on at the same time, they pinch the side of my face, you know, my, my temples, and it gives me a headache after a while. So there's so many things to think about, but like I said before, they need to feel substantial and high fashion. And I've made the pouch, the gold uh, clutch, with an attached cleansing, uh, cleansing cloth, so you never lose it, and it's also more protection around your glasses. You're always having smudges on your glasses. Oh. And I just, I think I thought of it all, and I think that, the price point was very important to me because I know what nine and twenty dollar glasses are like, and I know what three hundred dollar glasses are like, and I wanted to be able to make this this price point, but they needed to be the same as the three hundred dollar glasses, which just mark them up so much more mm -hmm. and are just ripping you off. It's you're true. You're not getting anything different. You're just getting a different brand name, and you're just getting ripped off. If and I the, can say that, I mean, it's the truth. Right, and I know sometimes we're tempted to just spend that $9, but are you getting 100% UVB, UVA protection? Are you getting the scratch-resistant lenses? Are you getting those spring action hinges? Are you getting this kind of look, this kind of comfort? I know the answer to those questions, and it is no. I do too. It is it no. It is absolutely no. The no. only way you'll know the difference is to let us get these off to you and try them. I really, I'm so impressed with how much attention to detail you give. I never thought about how they give you a frame around the eyebrow. That never occurred to me, Bethany. Great point. Well, because I, I, it bothers me. It cuts you off, and I've looked at it on everyone, and I like how they open up your face. And it has to, you know, and I and also, I don't like when it doesn't cover, I have black circles that go down, I have the black circles when I have the black, cir the black, you know what I mean? They go down a little lower. The concealer's gotten lower. It used to be just right under the eye. Then it goes a little lower because I get that purple. I just want to put on the glasses, mm -hmm. be cute, and put on some lip gloss. <laughs> this is what this is. This is what it is. And I don't have time, and I, I like to...
not wear a lot of makeup because I don't like yep. to trap my skin. I would rather yep. just let my skin breathe. I never do hair or makeup unless I absolutely have to for some reason. I so couldn't. I like to throw on the glasses. Yep. Yeah, right? You hate it. Throw I mean, your hair in a ponytail put on a baseball cap, whatever. I mean, you're running to the grocery store, of course. You know, you're always gonna run into somebody you know you don't wanna see when you're not wearing makeup, but you're wearing sunglasses. <laughs> so, and they're I, a fashion statement now. They are absolutely. Part, they're part of the whole look, you know? So I, I know I'm gonna see someone who rides out on the beach and I'm gonna take a picture of myself. It's like, boom, okay. Because <laughs> it makes all the difference in the world. It's it does. Just the truth. It frames your face, yeah. it opens it up, and it can make your cheekbones look, you know, mm -hmm. higher. And, True. It's just a true. Great, it's great. It makes you gives you a little personality, gives you a little sort of confidence. Yeah, you know? I love that. Well, these are the brown, most popular. We do have the black. We also have the uh, silver gray. So take advantage of all three if you'd like. If you can't decide, go for it. Because you know what? You can if you spend seventy five dollars in your HSN card today.